Hello everybody, that's Arthur and today I would like to make a short video to tell you more about our latest model, the Vector Typhoon with a light battery. <coughs> As you can see, there is no controller tray under the frame. Uh, everything is located inside the battery and the controller, so visually the bike became uh, smaller and lighter which make it uh, more stealthy and a bicycle look. Uh, I just took it for a ride and I should tell you the bike has definitely the same amount of torque and uh, power as the Typhoon with a bigger battery. Uh, actually it, it, it should be like this because the bike has the same components um, I mean controller and uh, motor but the only difference the battery is uh, uh, smaller in volume uh, and capacity the battery can provide the same amount of current as a big battery and uh, I already tested this uh, particular bike and it's easily can reach 85 kilometers per hour uh, not on the fully charged battery with a 4T 4 turn motor. Uh, I will remind you that we have 3, 4, 5 and 6T motor for any top speed you would like to have on the bike. Uh, my personal favorite is 5 and 4T. If you plan to ride slower in the forest or mountains, 5, 6T would be preferable. If you ride mostly on asphalt or a city, you can go with a 4T and if you need even higher speeds than 90, then you can go with a 3T motor. So, as you can see, uh, this bike is made in full black. The side panels can be customized. Um, the bike equipped with a front and rear light. It has basically the same components as a original Typhoon bike, uh, again the only difference is the battery size. The, big, uh, the bike due to smaller lighter battery and uh, losing the controller shield became approximately 6-7 kg lighter. So now uh, it is not only visually smaller but also lighter and uh, one more um, uh, you can remove of course the battery now from the bike and charge it outside uh, of the bike uh, if you live in an apartment or you want to take battery with you uh, i will repeat it's also now possible all you need to do is just to open side cover and uh, in a matter of minute you will remove your battery and you will be able to take it with you uh, you can see here our new kickstand which we uh, produce for our Typhoon bikes and here the bike stand on a hill and it's leaning on its side as you can see from the video I hope it will be uh, clear the angle here and as you can see the kickstand can hold the bike uh, no problem whatsoever so uh, yeah uh, we have requested many questions about this particular bike because not everybody needs a huge range but uh, of course uh, most of you guys want to have the same level of acceleration as uh, our top performers so this bike is definitely can give you that uh, with two kilowatt hour battery um, it is capable of doing uh, 60 kilometers uh, ride with approximately average speed of 35 40 kilometers per hour and if you go slower it can go even more uh, but yeah if you will ride it fast and uh, in the forest and so on I think uh, you can reach 50 kilometers per hour which is absolutely fine uh, for some of you and uh, I should say you can have uh, two batteries if you think one is not enough 
you can just swap them and then you have four kilowatt hour in total so uh, that's it for now uh, as I said it will be a short video if you have any questions about this bike or any other please uh, you can send us email or leave your comment under this video thank you and goodbye Perfect. <laughs> Thank you. Good. <laughs> Good.